Hey Virgo, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for your likes, subscribes, and shares. If there's anything else you'd like to know about me, it's in the description. This reading will be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Keep in mind, you do not have to be a Virgo to resonate with this reading. Please take what resonates and leave the rest. Cross watchers are welcome. I am available for personals. That information is in the description. Okay. Spirit ancestors. Oh my goodness. Spirit, ancestors, angels, and guides, thank you so, so much for all that you do for me. Thank you for loving, guiding, and protecting me. Please allow me to connect to the collective sign of Virgo and give guidance and advice to those who need it. Also, please surround me with a protective white light of the highest frequency and only allow positive energy into my space. Amen. 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 Hey, Virgo, royalty, gang, gang. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are taking care of yourselves because I am. Well, at least I'm trying to. Um, why does this look good to me? I don't know. All right, I'm going to leave it alone, I swear. Wait. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Okay, so let's get some messages from your person, okay? This is a twin flame deck. So let's see what's going on here. and karmic deck so we'll see what comes out let me not jump to the conclusion i hate when my cards start bending backwards okay so the first card we have is need time to heal Right now, I'm in a space where I need to focus on my healing and self-love. This isn't about you. It's about me. Finally, this is what you were trying to explain to this person. Your perfection, your beauty amazes me. I'm not sure how I am attracted to someone like you, but I'm forever grateful. Virg, 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 what, if, what have you done? No one compares. No matter how many people I've met and, exper and experiences I have, there's no one who compares to you. So they were trying to find you and other people. Nobody is ever going to compare to you. I keep telling people, like, no two people are the same. No two birth charts, no two fingerprints. The audacity when coming across somebody that's highly spiritual. The audacity of people. They don't know that you're not new to this, you're true to this. I guess they fucked around and found out. Emotional intimacy. I'm afraid to truly open up to you. Being raw and authentic with my emotions is something I'm still working on. So whoever this person is, they're still working on being authentic because they've been wearing a mask or, yeah, they've been wearing a mask for a long time or just being egotistical. We live in a narcissistic society. Okay, this isn't goodbye. I don't want to walk away, but it's what's best for me and us right now. This isn't goodbye. We will be together again soon. Okay, low key sounding like a like a twin. Lots of healing here. Lots of emotional expression. Unclear. I don't know how I feel about this connection anymore. So this person, they just I feel like you both need time apart and you both need to love on yourselves. My dreams. I've been dreaming about you. In my dreams, we are so free and in love. I wish I could stay there forever. Mm. Then we have, it's really simple. How do I feel? I want you, us, forever. Oh, okay. It sounds like a twin. I'm still going to make it weird anyway. 
So I'm going to use the character Oracle deck. I have not used this deck yet, so I will figure I use it in a spread. Clarify with the tarot. You already know. We have Challenger, Seeker of Adventures, Courage, Challenge, and Goal. So this person could be an adventure seeker, right? Um, they like challenges. They um, This could be somebody that likes to kind of live on the edge. We have Reader, Seeker of Knowledge, Knowledge, Pursuer, Explorer of Information. This person may know that you're a reader and they watch you, 555 on a recorder. You're perfect to this person. If you're a reader and you're just like wondering about somebody and how they feel about your job and what you do for a living, this pe this person thinks that you're perfect just the way you are. Okay. We have vendor. Merchant, retailer, and individual entrepreneur. So this could be you or them. Um, I feel like either you own your own business or you work for yourself. Um, so does this person. This person may own their own business and work for themselves as well. This person actually likes the fact that you're very spiritual. Maybe this person didn't see the value um, in it before, but that's too many. That's too many. All right, spirit. Talk to me. <laughs> okay, we have athlete. Seeker of... My fingernail just fell off. How rude. Okay, seeker of vitality, exercise, life, strength, speed. Okay, this person's working on themselves, not just spiritually or emotionally, but definitely um, physically as well. This person, they're really trying to personally find their own balance. Then we have careerist, dreamer of grand schemes, vision, scunning, scunning. What the frick is scunning? <laughs> Cunning, Mac. Machination, aspiration. I don't know. Look at this. This could be you. This isn't goodbye. Okay, so this person, they're in their era of a cunning vision. Something they're trying to bring to fruition. This could be a fire sign. I didn't even get to the tarot yet, but... This could be definitely a fire sign, without a doubt. It's, just, it's a lot of reds and oranges out here. Um, we are in the year of the dragon. So you're going to see fire symbols everywhere. Like everything is going to be fire, 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 because this is the year of the dragon. Drunker, alcoholism, addiction, avoidance, and abuse. Somebody is abusing substances or they have an addiction to something. It could be sex, alcohol, drugs, food. It could be anything, okay? And on the bottom, we have diviner. Seer of the unseen, foresight, insight, cosmic connection. Yeah, because you're a cosmic motherfucker. They ain't knowing. I guess they ain't knowing. They thought she was faking it. All right. As I split the deck, we have the Wheel of Fortune. So yeah, you definitely have some good coming to you here. This, is, this reading is for a reader. I mean, it doesn't have to be if it, resonate, it resonates, but 
Um, this, this reading is for a reader. Because sometimes um, other readers will come out in my readings. Well, dang. I'll take them. I won't take them. Okay, we have the Four of Cups Reverse. You could be Virgo. You may have felt like you may have felt like something or someone was not a challenge, and you're seeking a challenge. We have the judgment reverse. Like I don't really see you taking anybody back right now, and I don't think it really has anything to do with them. I think it has more to do with you for the simple fact that um, you know that it's your time to heal. Because if you don't heal now, then you're going to forfeit something. I don't know what that is. It could be, you know, a goal or a dream. Or it could be a relationship. The right relationship. Okay, we have the Nine of Cups. How you feel towards this person? Like, this person is your wish fulfillment. You're this person's wish fulfillment. Six of Pentacles reverse. Many of you, you became a reader because there you were in a connection where it wasn't equal give and take. It was a one-sided connection. I don't know who was doing the one-sidedness. Okay, we have the Page of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. This person is not telling you right now, but no one compares to you. They tried to find you with other people, but they're not willing to tell you that right now. They're not willing to communicate that with you. But the Page of Cups Reverse also talks about bad news. So there's little to no communication here, okay? You could, be, you could have been dealing with a Scorpio. Definitely no communication here. This person, they see your vision. That's interesting. You and this person, you're not talking right now. It's, it's, there are some things that are definitely unclear here. We have the Page of Swords and the Obstacles and Blocks, but also this person is watching you. They miss the emotional intimacy with you. They're holding themselves back from actually sending a message or a call to you. Okay, we have the Seven of Cups. Too many options. This person feels like, and I'm going to just keep it 100, Virgo. Again, this person has experienced other people, but they're still, they're still looking for you and other people, but they're, they haven't found it. So they're working on this. How can I put this? Usually people that aren't ready for commitment. I don't they just want to go out and experience life. I get that. Um, it's one thing to be single and go out and experience other people without hurting people's feelings. And so what had happened here was this person thought that they could find another you, but in the end, they really only hurted them. Yeah, they only hurted themselves because... Some people do a lot of crap just to fill in their insecurities, just to cover things up. Okay, with the justice reverse. Somebody could be experiencing bad karma here. Somebody has a lot on their plate. I can say that. The five of wands upright. Um,
Yeah, so I'm hearing you two couldn't agree to disagree. Like maybe you both have two different goals and it's like you want to work on them separately first and then come back together or something like that. But more or less, this person, I'm also getting this person, their pride and ego is in a way as well with this Seven of Cups because they feel like they got a lot of options. They watching you, but they also watching other options. Make that make fucking sense. Four of Pentacles. Don't want to let you go. Been drinking. Somebody in this connection is a hoarder. Just saying. Six of Cups. Six of Cups. Blah, blah, blah. Six of Cups. What's wrong with me? I'm drinking some water. Some juice. Some something. These readings, they be draining. People think it's easy. Like, no, it's not easy. The magician on the bottom. Again, I feel like somebody's manifesting you or you could be manifesting at this time because we also have diviner on the bottom of the deck. You're very, you're very intelligent, very inquisitive, highly intuitive. Your spirit team, they like... <laughs> Oh my goodness, your spirit team, like, they can fuck around and find out too. Somebody's team is just, mm hmm. I, I don't want no trouble, Virgo. Like, I don't. Or cross watcher. I don't want no, I don't want no trouble. Because whoever I'm reading for, they, they spirit team don't mess around. And these people need to make up their minds and stop playing with you. Yeah, because we have true gem. This person, they know you're a true gem. Whether male or female, this is how you are. 17, 17 on the recorder. Like we not going in. And then we have spiritual growth here. So it's like you're on your path, okay? Doing your spiritual work, expanding the soul, learning and growing, okay? Now people want to see the value in you and they know now that you're a quality person. Quality is always better than quantity. Courting man, uniform professional male. Okay, so whether male or female, you cross watching, gender doesn't matter. But, hmm. There is somebody here that wants to court you. There's somebody here that wants to court you. I think I might do like 30 minutes from this and I'm, I'm burnt out, y'all. Hopefully I spoiled y'all enough today to give you two long readings, which are very draining. Um, career, obstacles, and blocks. This person's still working on themselves. Again, like... They hide behind a mask, okay? We have passion, chemistry. This isn't goodbye, but this person, they have very passionate feelings about you. Could be. It's like you two fight the makeup. I'm here on makeup sex. Hey, don't shoot the messenger. Work, profession, college, workplace. You may have met this person in a professional setting or in college or at work. But somebody here that has to do with work is returning from the past. Again, if you don't like the way I read, you ain't got the be hot. <laughs> open relationship no commitment casual openness on the bottom so again this person has experienced other people but it's like none like you nothing like you well duh duh ya the fuck
child. So my, um, I'm getting 20, 30 on the recorder. Childhood like traumas. You may have children with this person. Okay, there, there could be a possible child involved. But what I'm getting with this card right here is right now I'm in a space where I need to focus on my healing and self love. Um, that that also consists of taking care of your inner child. This isn't about you. It's about me. So this person possibly are seeing the value in themselves and to all my men. Sorry, nobody told you that your body was just as sacred. Um, divine masculine, divine, the divine masculine and divine feminine. Stop stuttering. You know that's what we come to learn is that our bodies are sacred too, and it houses the spirit, the soul. Okay. Main female. Like you're the main person in this person's life like and what I mean by that is you have this person's heart they may have their body <laughs> you have this person's heart now I'm not saying that that's okay it, no by far it's not okay okay I'm not I'm not taking sides here like this is a good thing but sometimes people have to go through them things and there's a saying too this guy said we hurt the ones we love most. Um, like, as far as relationship. We have coffin here. Yeah, they're like bored. We have death under here. Ooh. Page of Cups. I don't really know karma involved. I'm just going to say that how this person feels is like they don't, 2233, like they don't want this right now. Okay. I'm not going to get, in, it depends. It depends. I'm not done this reading. I'm not ready to get weird yet. I don't see that. Or. They're possibly trying to work on themselves and, and end all this toxic fuckery they're doing. Because, yeah. Journey, obstacles, and blocks. This person, you know what? This person, they're focused on their success. Um, they kind of feel like they want to be in a better space before they get in a connection. Wealthy man, this isn't goodbye. 2332 might mean something to somebody. Yeah, this isn't goodbye. We'll be together again. Interesting. Yeah, somebody's trying to get where they want to be in life before they get into a connection. And again, for some of you, you triggered somebody's spiritual awakening. But we have expectation here. Hmm. I know this person's watching you. I don't know why I'm getting that. This person is definitely watching you. And on the bottom, we have mature man. Okay, so we have wealthy man, mature man. Main female, courting man. Um, who are all these people? The fuck? Who are all these people, her? Please tell me it's just family, you know. Okay. Insane chemistry like each other equally having fun. So you like each other equally. I'm definitely getting twin flame off the bat. Mirror. Mirroring each other, self-image, relationships reflect our wounds. Introspection. So y'all are mirroring each other. Oh, we got the spiritual growth going on, the expanding of souls. We got ascension, ascending, transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for your union.
Okay, so this person, they're trying to end all their toxic shit. Interesting. You caused this person to have a spiritual awakening. <laughs> Why you do that, Ver? Why you do that? Why you be doing that to people? Okay, we have date. Meeting someone new, dating, get back out there, plan, set a date. So this person, right now, this person is trying to take up, take care of themselves. They're not dating right now. They they did meet people, but they're bored with those people. <laughs> we have kisses, unconditionally loving, giving, and receiving affection, falling in love. Somebody love you. Somebody love you. Girl talk. Time with friends. Moving on. Happily single. Living in the moment. Having fun. Yeah. So you both, there's little to no communication here, but you both are definitely marrying each other in this connection. So this is telling me that maybe you both could be, you know, dating, um, talking to people or maybe you both you both are happily single in the moment we have the butterfly relationship evolving to the next fight the evolving to the next phase healing the inner child and growth okay healing the inner child this person's trying to heal their inner child and i feel like virgo you are too because um Many of you that watch my channel, you're like star seeds, light workers, readers, you know, chosen ones, targeted individuals. You, you just, you got a lot going on and it's all because of your spiritual expansion. It's just that time. That sound like a cardinal. I've been trying to see a cardinal. I'm seeing one. I had some bird food or something. Okay, I see apology here. Again, if you feel like I use a lot of cards because somebody said that, um, that sounds personal. Don't come over here trying to be important. Homeless. Okay, so somebody could be homeless right now. Failure, cast away, poor. Somebody wants to work on their finances and get stable. We have blessing, fulfillment, well-being, and enlightenment. Yeah, y'all are marrying each other. Um, there's blessings coming in for you and your twin. Now, I'm not saying to take your twin back if all this is going on. That's totally up to you. Um... I'm not trying to tell nobody how to live their life, but if you know a situation isn't good for you as your big little sister, um, yeah, you deserve better than that. Know your worth, know your values, you know. That's where we at in this game. That's way too many. Okay. Ooh, marionette, dictatorship, domination, reluctance. Let me find out, is the karmic interrupting? Don't interrupt. Let me see. Let me see. Let me get this all out. Saving, perseverance, collection, and meanness. Okay. Somebody's saving their energy, okay? I don't know if somebody was controlling in this situation, but somebody may have walked away because they felt like they were being dominated and controlled like a puppet. And yeah, you're nobody's puppet. We have gain, cultivation, profit, and conclusion. Because I can't see. Okay. This isn't goodbye, but you both are like, okay. I have some things to focus on. This person is very unclear about this connection and they're praying about it. 
We have vow, uh, wish, hope, and worship. You have somebody here that's praying about this connection. They're praying for you. That's a cardinal. That's either a blue jay or a cardinal. Okay, on the bottom we have disturbance, obscure irritation, and supernatural. I'm getting like you spooked this person out. Some of you are practitioners, readers, again, you, you are basically in the spiritual community, okay? Or you're just somebody that's highly spiritual and quiet about it. Um, but some of you have had supernatural disturbances around you and vice versa. This person has had supernatural disturbances around them, 2131 on the recorder. schedule, goal. Somebody's trying to reach a goal. Be it you or them. Adventure. Sweet dreams. Fate. Coincidence. Fatalism. And fortune telling. And I'm also getting to don't shoot the messenger. But if this is you and you are highly spiritual... There is warfare involved. There's, you shouldn't have no supernatural disturbances. That's not, it's not natural. And if you're dealing with or you left somebody that's toxic, you need to do some spiritual cleaning because relationships with narcissists and toxic people, they, it's not natural. That's why abuse is here and addiction and avoidance. We have let the truth reveal itself. Right. Yep, leave it behind. Whatever this is, like you, you have to leave it behind, or you're forfeiting something. Okay. Consider all of your possibilities before you act. Think before you leap. Okay? You're focused on your healing. You're focused on just sitting still. A reconciliation, a lost love returns, or a rift is mended. Possibly a gift of money. Okay, what I'm getting is, I don't like this. I, I, I know exactly how I'm going to name this. I know exactly. And we have stand up for what you believe in, okay? that's the, Somebody came in between what you believe in, but this is a new phase where you have to stand up for what you believe in, regardless if you're being targeted, stalked, harassed. We are in the era of authenticity. We are in the era of the black sheeps, the seers. The readers, the healers. Somebody tried to treat you like a regular schmegula. Victory is yours. All your problems are being moved out of the way. You have success. Okay. We have loss. You may have lost this person or somebody. There was somebody in your life. It could be a family member. It could be a co-worker. But there's somebody here that was like a, acting like a dictator in your life. And you're like, what the fuck? You're, you're just at that place where you're like, look, I'm going to stand up for what I believe in. I'm going to move on to this new phase. And I'm just going to trust the creator because... Maybe somewhere in the past you trusted man over the creator. And I mean, sometimes we do it, you know. Um, I did it. That's how, you know, I lost my channel and 
I was just doing other things before the creator and yeah. I paid the I paid the consequences, but God is like, um, yeah, but you ain't gotta go through all that. You attract jealousy. Exactly. You ain't gotta go through all that. So because people see what you have coming as a reader, a healer, somebody that um is gonna give the world hope and encourage them and inspire them and be, you know, empower people. You attract jealousy. This ain't got nothing to do with what you look like. Nada. Celebrity. Yeah, you're like a celebrity. You're a celebrity in a spiritual community. You know, a lot of us that been here for years, we are considered uh, influencers, celebrities, content creators. You know, we're in the public eye. So because you're in the public eye, if you resonate with this, you attract jealousy. Period. Point blank. Manifestation. Someone is manifesting you. It better be manifestation, not magic. I mean, same difference, but it's not the same thing. I just saw spiritual warfare. Okay, we have false person. So when you two separated, somehow, some way, a false person stepped in the middle. Yeah, toxic situation, false person. This person, y'all are mirroring each other. So this person could be with a toxic person. You may have been with a toxic person and left them. But toxic people attract supernatural disturbances, period. Y'all know that energy I'm talking about? Heartbreak. Somebody's praying because, and then I see sadness. Somebody is praying because their heart is broken. Black sheep. The black sheep clarifying. Look at that heartbreak card. Clarifying this. Hold it. We have vow and we have the black sheep. People were so committed to misunderstanding how you move that they don't hurt their own selves. We have total success, money, love, and joy. And then on the bottom, we have small improvements. Yeah, you're making small improvements. And that's all that matters, Virgo. Like, if you're a spiritual person and you experience this attack, because I saw super the uh, <coughs> spiritual warfare card. If you are this person and you fell, please get up. Please and thank you. Freedom and prosperity. You may end up being with a Libra. I just saw Libra and luxury. All is well and you are blessed, highly favored. Somebody may try to blackmail you though. I knew it was going to get weird. Jealousy. Prayer is an all-purpose weapon. Prayer is an all-purpose weapon. Stop playing with these people. Use some tools to master your reality. Somebody may have just gotten a divorce. They never had your back. Not over it. Uh, so there's somebody that's not over it. Like, they're not over it. Spiritual warfare and spying. <sighs> no. I, let, me, let me get an oracle card. Because no. Because no. I know you fucking lying. Archangel Michael, please show up. Please show up and show out. What is this? No. Oh, no. Spirit snitching. Spirit is snitching, snitching, snitching. There's magic involved in your connection. And some of you... Oh, oh, oh. Because you have gifts. Like, you have real gifts. Like telepathic communication, psychic abilities, ESP. Like you have real gifts. You were attacked. Open up to your spiritual gifts. Woo! I can't make this up. 
I can't make it up. Remember that your true nature is spiritual, not physical. The angels are sending you messages to guide your soul's growth. Exactly. 4040 on the recorder. My team don't play with me. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Ah. <laughs> Okay, Virgies, this is all I have for you. Thank you so much for tuning in. You know I love you guys, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.